knocked out or until she's not going to strike. A reasonable juror could weigh, then the matter survives a motion to strike. There we go. In this matter, there is evidence no. in the case that a jury could weigh that the statements were made by the defendant, that the statements were about the plaintiff, that the statement was published, that the statement is false, and the defendant made the statement knowing it to be false, or the defendant made it so recklessly sure. as to amount to a willful disregard for the truth. man. She already made her the decision of that evidence is up to the fact finder. So the motion to oh, strike she knew this would happen. Statement. She had this pre-thought out. Uh, the motion to strike as a statement, one, I'm going to take under advisement because um, if it's not a stipulation, I'm not sure what it is, but there seems to be an agreement that the tweet of Ms. Heard is part of the plaintiff's evidence, which is not in evidence at this point. So I can't rule on that statement whether or not it is just a tweet or if it's some sort of republication or something. An admission I don't in know her answer, I though. I haven't seen it yet. So as to the motion to strike on, on statement one, I'm going to take an advisement because ruling on it now, it would be premature because I just don't have that evidence in the case. Okay. Thank you very much, Ron. All Thank right. You. Since it's 1230, we don't, you want to just take lunch? Lunch uh, break. Go ahead and, and let then the jurors go to lunch and come back at 130. Does that sound yeah. okay? Yeah. Ben Chu has to go pound one out in the bathroom uh, after that. <laughs> okay. I mean, she knew that was coming. She 